Hey, 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 happy day 597. Sharon Horn Elstrom here, also known as the Pajama Grandma, not in my pajamas. I'm actually at, you can see behind me, one of my very favorite places, my new favorite places in my hometown. And actually, as a kid, I didn't really come here very much, but since I'm in a temporary house in town, I come here whenever it's not raining. <laughs> Sometimes when it's raining, but hopefully when it's not raining. But today, let's chat just for a minute about rest and relaxation. Today, I've got my sweatshirt on that says relax. It's my very favorite one. I actually took it off because I went for a walk and I'm all sweaty. You can probably tell. And that is how I rest and relax. I go for walks. I go get out in nature. I do things. And you might be able to hear kids playing in the, pack, the background because in motorcycles downtown. You can see downtown. Because there's, it's a beautiful day. It's, it was rainy before but now it actually looks pretty gorgeous out and so I'm glad I came for a walk but that's what I do for rest and relaxation I get outdoors and I do something fun usually with other people but I also love to just spend time alone spend time thinking and just contemplating and recharging my batteries you know they say we can only recharge our batteries when we sleep but I think we can recharge our batteries when we spend time in nature when we just spend time thinking and unwinding and un I guess un Raveling some of the challenges that we actually create for ourselves. So share in the comments below. What do you do for rest and relaxation? What is your favorite pastime when it comes to recharging your batteries? Share in the comments below because of this crazy wazy pajama grandma would love to know. Working on the One Funnel Away Challenge today. Haven't done it yet. Had a sleepover with the four-year-old and then went tile shopping yet again for the rehab for the remodel of my house and my sister's house as well. So keeping busy doing things besides work-related online business things and that's good too because that's another way that we rest and recharge and we rethink and get ideas that can help us move our other projects ahead. Go out, have an amazing day and an amazing weekend and I'll of course see you tomorrow probably back in my old haunt, not out in beautiful nature, letting you know what I'm up to now. Take care, have an amazing day. I'll of course be with you tomorrow. Bye.